Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome now to Istanbul for tonight's basketball championship fixture here in day three between Besiktas and Ritas Vilnius. Well, ladies and gentlemen, these two teams now in a very competitive group H where everybody in the group is now one win and one loss, and it is all business to play for live here in Istanbul. Ritas Vilnius now be coming off the back of a very impressive victory at home where they took care of business against Carrera San Pablo Burgos in which many did not expect them to win so emphatically off the two-time champions of the basketball Champions League they can see because the team flying with confidence for well, other games tonight you can see Carrera San Pablo Burgos they'll be taking on Yui Baskets Oldenburg that will take place later this evening but right now it's all about the game here in Istanbul We'll take a look at some of the lineups, of course, with percentage-wise. You know, but shit, this are looking the much stronger this team. The only statistic that reaches Vilnius are slightly better than the home side is in the free throws, of course. But the permanent shooting much more dominant coming from the Turkish team. Well, there you can see reaches Vilnius after their very big victory. I mean, it was a statement victory for the Lithuanians against the two-time champions, Arena San Pablo Burgos. I mean, that was a marker for the season to let everybody know that in their second year they really do mean business here in the basketball champions league well, you can see the Besiktas fans in the back and again it was a fantastic atmosphere in Vilnius only two week two weeks ago and again this is what the basketball champions league is all about again these fans weren't here last year being back in the stadium means so much to them and it is going to be a very competitive matchup the players to look out, of course, you know, Ivan Buva, the Croatian international, 30 years of age, is arguably one of the best players in the basketball champions. They get post up player. Magiris Normantis came off very big in their victory against Hereda San Pablo Burgos. And not to mention Anas Kukevicis. The players of these they can go to, of course, but, you know, Besiktas, a team that, you know, really has of some enforcements that can get a lot of points in the likes of Jordan Bowen, not to mention Diedrich Lawson. Lawson, of course, making the changeover from the Korean Basketball League where he spent the last few seasons. No doubt this will be a very, very big season for him. But one of the biggest signings has to be one day Hollis Jefferson. I mean, he is huge now coming into the prime of his career. And Captain Mehmet Yamor, of course, now 34 years of age. Trevon Kuyet as well. Not to mention the likes of Erchan Osmani as well. This is going to be a very big season here for Besiktas, a team that has been in the Basketball Champions League before. But again, falling short of expectations. We're thinking about some of the rivals that Besiktas have here in the Basketball Champions League. The biggest one, of course, being Pinata Kashiaka, a team that made it to the final last season. And just came up short, losing to Hereda San Pablo Burgos. And no doubt this Besiktas team will want to get to that stage and, you know, be considered a team that means being able to bring the championship home. Tempo will be key in this game, of course. I mean, we've talked a lot about the perimeter shooting, but, you know, with a team like Rita Vilnius, they're going to want to try and play down low as much as possible with the likes of Ivan Buba. Rebounding will be key for them. And no doubt they're going to have to try and control the tempo as much as possible. Because when you're on the road here in the basketball Champions League, it becomes very, very tough. And Speedy Smith playing now into his veteran years. They definitely have a big say there. You can see Speedy Smith being a primetime shooter from the perimeter. And there's also number 18, Mindaugas Kajunas as well. Another player that came off the bench and gave some very, very good minutes. But number eight, Vardas. Karen Nialskis is key in their matchup, a six foot six perimeter player. And they're going to try and make sure that he gets off the run this evening against a very good Besiktas team. Well, Dijek Lawson was a member of the BCL Trash Tour podcast where he was on the first ever show and said that one thing you know about Dijek Lawson, the kind of player he is, is to give 110% effort on the rebound and in the low block. Statistically, if you look at Besiktas, of course, I mean, they're only averaging just under seven three-point field goals per game. I mean, top scoring, of course, coming from Jordan Bone. 
And the likes of Hollis Jefferson, so no doubt they've been on the scouting report. And that's a DJ Wilson just averaging under three rebounds to get that double-double with 11 and seven. Followed by Isaiah Whitehead. He had 12 points in his first game. And it's gonna be a very, very key matchup. Joshua Reeves as well. Home tonight. And there's their coach, Ahmed Kandemir. He's been with Besiktas for a very, very long time now. Very well respected basketball coach. Made the during the last season. It's now his second time coaching. Sorry, third time matches. He started back in 1997. Well, ladies and gentlemen, must pay homage to our officials for tonight's fixture. And our officials are coming from Slovenia, Ukraine, and the Belarus. We've got Boris Krejic, Sergei Zaschuk, and Andrei Sharapa. Again, we're very proud to say we're some of the finest officials here in World Basketball. They've done an excellent job in all of our competitions, and they'll continue to do so here tonight in game day three in Istanbul of the Basketball Champions League. Just to see how these two teams start out. Of course, what kind of lineups they go with. I would be very, very surprised. Let's see Dietrich Wilson in the starting lineup again. Will he match up with Ivan Buva? Buva being one of the predominant back down post players. That's good. There are our officials for tonight's game. And again, we're very proud of the work from Slovenian national Boris Krejic, Ukrainian national Sergei Zaschuk, and Belarusian national Andrei Sharapa. Thank you the hard work and loyalty of all of our officials and they've done an excellent job and they will continue to do so here tonight. Well, if we saw Ritas Vilnius, I mean, Karen Nialskis in the game against Hereda San Pablo Borgos, he was phenomenal in the backcourt. Not so much going for those primitive shots, but getting to the basket and making the defense collapse of San Pablo Borgos. Speedy Smith did come off the bench, but again, what a great shooting night he had. The question is, will we be able to do the same here against Jordan Bone? Karen Yaskis, he will start in the point guard role. Nomantis will partner him. Bukevicis will also play the three role tonight. Gitas Rajevicis will be partnered along with Ivan Buba. So it's kind of a small lineup they've got with Ivan Buba as their center. Nonetheless, a very effective lineup. And there's Gedris Jimenez, the head coach of Ritas Vilnius. And a man who's just only stepped into that role. Spent a brief little bit of time coaching in Indonesia. Also with, with basketball Champions League rivals, Kalev Kramo. And there is the starting lineup. Furkan Haltali along with Trevon Bouliet, Diedrich Lawson, Isaiah Whitehead, and Joshua Reeves all make the starting lineup for the home team. And there is the head coach, Ahmet. Kandemir, as we mentioned, started his professional career as a coach back in 1997 with Besiktas. Spent some time with Pinar Kashiaka. But again, this is now his third stint, so a man very well accustomed to the expectations of coaching a high-profile team. Well, ladies and gentlemen, to all of our fans in Lithuania, back in Vilnius, Labas Vakaras, or maybe Labadiana, depending what time of day it is for you, welcome here to Istanbul. And to all of our fans here in Turkey, Merhaba and E Akshamlar, welcome. It is now game day three of the Basketball Champions League. It is Besiktas Ahos against Ritas Vilnius. Both these two teams now, one win and one loss each. Question is who will go to two and one? Who will pick up their second defeat? We'll find out live. Don't go anywhere. As we're set for tip, this is the Basketball Champions League. Well, 
Well, tip is underway, and it will be Ritas Vilnius who get the first possession of the game here. It's Karen Jalskis. There's the ball up here for the visitors. Tempo will be key now. Tries to back down a low block. Spins around, goes with the left hand, gets rejected. Well, they saved the ball, and now you can see they can push this one. Well, great defensive play there by the Besiktas defense. Passes this one up now. The foul has been called. They caught a charger, an offensive foul caught against. Shake this on offense. Well, great defensive play there. Well, here you can see the movement off the ball. Well, Diedrich Lawson, again, I felt he got bumped on that one, but again, they're going to give the ball here to Aritas Vilnius. Well, that's just intelligent play there. From the Ritas Vilnius players, I mean, just drawing that foul, and there you can see Joshua Reeves laughing that one off. But the officials now will get things underway. Comes off one screen now, hangs in the air. Karen Yelskis gets it. No, he does not. Bounces off the rim. We saw that time and time again. Against the Red of San Pablo Borgos at home in their first victory. But again, he's going to have to work a lot harder tonight. Mahal's well, Jefferson now. They get the three. The three is in the corner. It's up. It's no good. Ivan Buva with a rebound. And now, Ritas Vilnius will push this one. Karen Yelskis comes up one screen. Kicks this one out. Good ball movement here. Comes up one screen now. No matches down the middle. Kicks this one out. They get the three. The three is up. The three is good. Well, from downtown, Achu from Anes Budkevicius. Nails a tree ball. Well, Budkevicius now proving to be to go back door now in the lane. Two handed jam time. Well, oh, beautiful play there. The pass came and Joshua Reeves with a throwdown. Well, the Ritas Vilnius defense just got called into question there with the back door play. Mattis now looking for the pick and pop, kicks this one out. Well, Kevin's just now looking to back down. Another kick out, Norm Mattis, he goes down the middle. Puts up a circus shot, doesn't get it, but Kevin's just with a rebound. Bit of contact, he gets fouled. And now, on this, but Kevin just will go to the free throw line here for two shots. The foul is on Furkan Haltali. Hopefully, oh, shake us. This all starts, starts with but Kevin just going in for that second chance opportunity, getting the ball, and drawing the foul. Second chance points will be pivotal to both these two teams in this game. Johannes Budkevicius, originally from Clydebeda, Lithuania, 29 years of age. Played for that team as Clydebeda in the basketball Champions League before making the move to Ritas Vilnius as he makes a second free throw. Joshua Reeves now gives this one up. Finds Isaiah Whitehead. Whitehead goes to the lane with a little finger roll. Can't get it. Secures a rebound. And now Ritas Vilnius can push this one. Karnyowskis now goes down low. Finds Ivan Buva. Buva gets his pocket pick by Furkan Haltali. He goes out of bounds. And it will be baseline ball now to Ritas Vilnius. Tries to curl off one screen. Finds Bukevicius. He's down the middle. Another kick out. Almost got his pocket picked. Karen Yaskis goes down low now to Ivan Buba. Here comes the back down. Down the middle. Puts up a circus shot. Doesn't get it. Haltali with a rebound. Whitehead now pushes in transition. Pump fakes now. Diedrich Lawson looking to give this one up. Great help side defense. And this is good ball movement now from Besiktas. And the shot didn't take it. Now we're under 10 on the shot clock here. Crosses over down the middle, gets his pocket pick. Well, Haltali has to shoot it, puts a shot up, airballs it with the follow up by Diedrich Lawson. Well, Diedrich Lawson there did so well because Haltali with the wild airball. Again, another second chance point here. This time for the home side. There's a pick and pop now, finds Pukevicius. And the matches, he pulls up the three, takes it from downtown, way off the mark. Kept alive and now, but Shaktis can push this one. And they got numbers. Aliutan Harika 
E Gachalar, Joshua Reeves. Oh, DJ Lawson throws it up to Shekular. Joshua Reeves with a two-handed throwdown on the alley-oop. And now Karen Yalskis gives this one up to Bukovic. And the movement here from Rutas Vilnius, a little bit too static. Kevin just now looking to back down. Finds Ivan Boot running the basket. No foul call. Keeps it alive. This time goes up with it. And a 24 second violation. Another turnover here. And now 6 4 here into the early stages. Almost halfway through the first quarter. The team's just taking their time to settle into this one. Looking for the pick and pop with Hautali. Well, Hautali now in the low block has to go to work. Kicks this one out. There's the three. The three is up. No good. Rebound secured here by Rajevicis. Now Karen Yaskas here. It's going to go pick and roll. And Ivan Muba comes off one screen, hesitates. Bit of contact. Gets rejected. Well, Hautali said, not in my house. Karen Yalskis, one of the best here in the basketball champions, getting to the basket. Oh, Mantis now. Cross-court pass, good ball movement. Had the shooter in the corner, didn't give it to him. This time takes a three-pointer, doesn't get it. And a foul has been called, and it's going to be called against Ivan Buva. But right now, you can see yeah, very physical defense here. Well, Besiktas causing all sorts of problems for Ritas Vilnius. Well, Besiktas now under halfway to go here in the first quarter. Still with the lead in this one. Good ball movement. This time takes a three point. Three is up. The three is good. Tucked away from downtown. Well, Trevon Bluet. Again, gaining some confidence there off the draw. Hits his first three point of the night. Speedy Smith has just checked in the game here for Ritas Vilnius. It's interesting that they start carrying the Houskis, who's a phenomenal player, but great work there by. Margiris Normantis there drawing the foul. Look at the rejection here by Haltali. Speedy Smith now looking to pick a pop, turns it over. And now Besiktas here. Slow this one down. Diedrich Lawson goes in the lane, lays it up. And right now, Ritas Vilnius half the court timeouts. Besiktas are running wild here at home in Istanbul. Well, now Speedy Smith will try to get things going here. And what reaches Vilnius need is a bit more confidence, a little bit more creativity in their offense. Well, there's the pick and pop. They try the three from downtown. The three-point struggle still continue from Ritas Vilnius.
on Marisa and Doa now checks into the game for them as well just to give him that extra option how he goes in with a left-handed layup doesn't get it and Doa with a rebound and now Speedy Smith here will try to get things going Will they go down low now in the lane now two-handed jam lays it up and that's much better well the double team came over against Yvonne Boomer and Doa they just made a beautiful cut to the basket Exactly what they need, a little bit more movement off the ball. Well, Deidre Lawson, he'll try a three-point. Deidre Lawson from downtown nails it. And there's a pick and pop side of his game we haven't seen too much of so far. But again, first season playing professional basketball here in Europe. It's an eight-point lead now to Besiktas. And Speedy Smith now run to ten on the shot clock. Smith's going to go pick and roll. And Yvonne Buva, Smith in the lane, hangs in the air, gets rejected. Well, great defeat defense there. And now Besiktas can push this one. Oh, it's beautiful. Showtime. Deidre Lawson is unstoppable. Well, Deidre Lawson is running the show right now as he gives Besiktas a 10-point lead. Well, Speedy Smith pulls up and takes a three points way off the mark. And at the moment, Rantis Villainous in need of some inspiration. Well, Josh Reeves now goes to the bench and gives a little bit of a breather. Again, a lot of changes and a lot of depth that these two teams have. As Egehan Adam now checks into the game, number 18. I mean, Douglas Kirjunas also checks into the game here for Rintas Vilnius. Right now here, almost gets his pocket picked. Turn the shot clock now. Got to get something going. Goes all the way to the basket. Tough layup right at the end of the shot clock. And that is simply unstoppable by Isaiah Whitehead. Well, Isaiah Whitehead had Maurice Andor all over him, but was still able to finish with a sweet little finger roll. Smith now gives this one up. And here comes a pick and roll sequence. Kicks out the speedy Smith. Had the shot, decided not to take it. Well, they got to force it up right at the end of the shot clock, way off the mark. And again, Maritza Vilnius cannot buy a bucket. Comes off one screen now. Here comes the movement as Mehmet Yamor checks into the game. The captain here for Bashik just download the Haltali under the basket. Got to finish it. Traveling violation. A great defense there. here with another chance but at the moment they just need some inspiration again nothing clicking for them just over a minute to go here in the first quarter Speedy Smith tries to break it down and Maurice Andor he'll try a three-pointer and again the three-point struggle still continue a great hustle there going out of bounds well you gotta love it from Arnis but Kevichis running out of bounds and throwing it off Mehmet Yamor I mean that's Dennis Rodman for the Chicago Bulls back in the 90s except but Kevin excuse me but Kevin just didn't land in the uh, in the crowd. Good Jonas now down the middle, pump face. Finds Maurice and Doe a little pick and pop. He can't get it. An easy rebound for Besiktas, and now they can push this one. Puts it behind his back now. Smooth move. Under finds Deidre Lawson. Lawson is unstoppable. Well, Deidre Lawson is going to have a buffet tonight. It's a 14 point lead here to Besiktas. Smith now comes off one screen, pulls up in the mid-range. Speedy Smith still can't get it to drop. And now Mehmet Yamor slow this one down here. 12 seconds difference between the game clock and the shot clock. They turn it over, but Kevich is with a steal. Well, 
Beautiful play there in the lane, lays it up. Oh, I missed the layup and the follow-up. The ball is all over the place. Speedy Smith comes up, he turned it over. Well, wasted opportunity there. Well, I mean, Douglas Gajunas had a wide open layup. Again, was just put under pressure. Unable to secure the ball. Goes out of bounds. And just comes off of Speedy Smith. So now Besiktas will have one opportunity now to get one last shot here. And you can see already going to put all their shooters onto the floor. Oh, Erchan Osmani checks into the game here as Mehmet Yamo, the captain, checks out. So now with 10 seconds left, what do they have? He brings the ball up and a smart foul there. Well, the foul is against Arnas Adamovicis, his first personal foul. Again, just trying to slow down Besiktas to get any chance of getting to the basket. Yeah, it's another clever foul. It's a tactical decision to put him in here. As he probably won't see too many minutes later on in the game, so why not prevent Isaiah Whitehead? And he did have 12 seconds, but now it's only 2.7 left here to get one last shot off. And it's as good as if they choose to do, have one last foul to give. But right now, Coach Cannon is going to call timeout and try and draw something up here. Look, Bashik to see with 2.7 to go in the first quarter. Play here, just finding Diedrich Lawson. Diedrich Lawson just so quietly crept into the low block and a great pass there by Trevon Blewett. With well, a one-two punch working really well with those two players. And now the question will be now with 2.7 seconds left, what do Besiktas have here in store for Ritas Vilnius, who've only scored what's been a very tough first quarter for them with six points, a very low scoring quarter. Well, the ball's going to be inbound here. Get the ball inbound. Has to take it. Fades away. Harika to Shekular. Right at the end of the first quarter. Trevon blew it. Well, you got to love this. Fading out of bounds. Igechalar. Good night, Istanbul. That is for you. Right at the end of the first quarter. And ladies and gentlemen, I had, think he had his foot on the line, so it will be a two point shot. As Besiktas are leading this one 22 6 over Ritas Vilnius in game day three of the Basketball Champions League Group H. Well, we'll take a look at some stats and some highlights in this game, but so far. Well, the problem for Reeds is Vilnius, they just haven't had enough good looks from the perimeter. They started off the game very well. They were controlling the tempo, but in the end, it really has been all Besiktas at the moment. And Reeds is Vilnius, as we mentioned, playing right now without any confidence, unlike the way they did at home against Hereta San Pablo Borgos, but that just shows you just how competitive the Basketball Champions League uh, is. And at the moment, they just need people to step in and step up right now. I mean, they haven't been able to get the ball down low to Ivan Buva because the post defense has been very strong here from Besiktas. Dedrick Lawson having a very good game. There's the alley-oop. At the moment, they're controlling this game with a 16-point lead. That was the fadeaway shot going out of bounds, and it just has been that evening so far. It's been all but shaked us at the moment. Well, Deidre Glosson, top scoring so far with 11 points.
And now the home side will have the first possession here. I think it was a pick and pop now. They're trying to isolate him on the low block, but again, again, it's been slow defense reaction here from Rita's Vilnius. Speedy Smith just got caught out there. Comes off one screen now. What a pass. Finds Haltelli under the basket. Easily tucks it away. Well, excuse me. That was Osmani, actually. Echan Osmani only just checked into the game at the end of the first quarter. There's an 18-point lead now to Besiktas. Get Jonas. And again, that's what you want to see from Ritas Vilnius. Attack the Besiktas defense. Force the officials to make a call right there. Beats him on the first step. And... Try and get into the penalty and make the Besiktas defense settle back. Right now, it's too easy for the hosts on defense coming up with loose balls and getting out in transition. Looking for the isolation now. A few seconds on the shot clock. Goes baseline. Kicks this one out. He's got to shoot it. The shot is up. Right at the end of the shot clock. Didn't get it. And now Besiktas can push this one. Egehan Anna now on the ball. Comes off one screen with DJ Glawson. And this time the foul is being called on Maurice Ndor. Oh no, the foul has been called on Osmani actually. Sorry, Air Chan Osmani gets called for the offensive foul. Well, my apologies, of course, to Maurice Ondor. I thought that the foul was called on him, but it's a careless turnover to give away. And now Bukovic is on the ball, looking for Gear Jonas. He's going to use the screen here with Maurice Ondor. Well, Maurice Ondor there had a good post, but they didn't get the ball to him. Crosses over two times, pump fakes in the lane, goes around. Well, Achu, Atsi Prasho. That is what they need, Mendogas Jonas with a double crossover pump fake and just able to get the shot off. Exactly what the doctor ordered at the moment because at the moment, Ritas Vilnius in need of a lot of inspiration. And there's a three, the three is up, the three is good. And yet again, Trevon Blewett punishing the Ritas Vilnius defense as Speedy Smith hit. Tries to go quickly in transition. We're looking to back down now. Door gets a handoff here with Speedy Smith. Back to the big fella. Well, triple team comes. Great defense. Lawson comes up with it. And he's fouled in transition. My honest, Bukevicius. point lead here to the hosts. Well, there's a lock pass. Great play there by Osmani. Got it by Speedy Smith, but the foul has been called. Smith just reached in. And there's a great seal off there. Oh, yeah, Chan Osmani. So now he'll go to the free throw line here for two shots. You're playing some good moment. A minute here for Besiktas. Just gets the free throw to knock in. Again, depth will be key for both of these two teams when they try to get into the playoff stages. Remember, everybody in the group is one and one at the moment. And we'll get to two for two from the charity stripe, and now it's a 21 point lead here to Besiktas. Maurice Ndor now will go to the bench to take a breather. So Ivan Buba comes back into the game here for Ritas Vilnius. And Ivan Buba in the lane, lays it up, and that's much better. Well, the pick and roll sequence there with Mindogas, Giajunas. Just exactly what they needed, a little bit more movement off the ball. 
That was one screen now in the lane. Looks for the love pass. And throws it out of bounds. Careless turnover. Well, Eggman Anna went down the middle and tried to throw a love pass there to Furkan Hatali. But Hatali was sealed off by two defenders, so it's another turnover. Now Speedy Smith hit. Let's get Jonas. Back to Smith. Tries another three-pointer downtown. Speedy Smith knocks it down. And that's much better there from the Lithuanians. Great ball movement. The penetration, the kick out in the first three points of the game for Speedy Smith. Takes a screen down the middle, tries to find the big fella, almost fumbles it. Haltali now tries to back down against Buba. Spins around, puts up a circus shot, doesn't get it. Shake this fighting for the rebound, but goes out of bounds, and it will be Ritas Vilnius' ball. And you can see Bashekta is fighting for every offensive board. Coach Kandemir, I believe he's having a word with Haltali to say she had to dish the ball off down low. Another turnover here for Bashiktas. Shake this now. Going for another change as Megahan Arna checks out of the game as Joshua Reeves comes back in. As Coach Kandemir really going to his bench now. So it's all the rotation he has with his players and just the amount of options he has. The question will be, will it be enough now? Good Jonas now goes down the middle. Looking for a kick out. Finds Bukevicius now. Here's where they want Ivan Buva to get the ball in the low block. Buva backs down, makes a bit of contact. Beautiful post move off the backboard. Can't get it. Nobody going in for a rebound. And that was a good move, but again, he needed somebody to follow up with a second chance as Speedy Smith picks up his second foul. Now the question is, Maritas Vilnius, do you send Speedy Smith to the bench now knowing he's picked up another foul because Isaiah Whitehead, I mean, look at this. This is a beautiful little pump fake right here, but nobody following up for an offensive rebound. And that's what Yvonne Buva needs somebody just to give him that extra bit of help in the low block. The sideline ball here is Joshua Reeves will inbound it. Just under six minutes to go as the foul was called on Bukevicius. So Karen Yowskis having just come back in, but Maurice Andor will also come back in. So now, with this villain, he's gone with a big lineup. And there's the shot off the screen. The shot is tucked away, beautifully executed off the screen. As Egehan Arna, who just subbed out of the game, is now back in. Door now looking for options, trying to throw it down low to the big fella. As Ivan Buva this time finds Gear Jonas. Back to Ivan Buva. Ivan Buva almost turns it over. Great defense there by Furkan Haltali. So now with three tenths of a second left on the shot clock. Maritas Vilnius, what can they get off here? They turn it over, and now Bashik just having this one in transition. Oh, it's an easy little finger roll. And right now, Ritas Vilnius had to call timeout. As Egehan Arna does so well there to run the fast break and come up with a finger roll.
Well, you just have to listen to these fans right now here in Istanbul. I mean, it's an unbelievable atmosphere. And this is what basketball is all about here in Turkey. The passion, the support, it's just phenomenal here. Remember these players, they missed this last season. But finally, these fans are back. Yeah, the atmosphere has been here phenomenal so far. I mean, again, it just gives these players an extra bit of motivation to play in front of this crowd and just to really give them something extra. The mental fatigue they went through last season, traveling from country to country here in the basketball champs league without any fans. Finally, to play in front of their home fans must be a great occasion here for all basketball teams over the basketball champions league. Now just over halfway to go here in the first half. Mintas Vilnius having a very, very tough game here. Only 13 points so far in the game as Karen Yauskas comes off one screen. He finds Ivan Buvis. Now Mindogas Gajonas comes off one screen. Now throws it down low again. And this is where Besiktas have been very good defensively. Buva goes in, turns around with a little jump hook. And that's much better. That's something he has to be more clinical of in this game. Something that Besiktas really have taken away from him. It's only his fourth point of the game this evening. Mohana kept, now comes up one screen, kicks this one out. Reeves takes a three-point in the corner, doesn't get it. An offensive rebound. Well, why not pulls the trigger downtown? The three is good. And right now, there's rain of threes here. As Yais Aksu now, you can see, nails that three-point. Only just checked into the game. A 21-point lead now to the hosts. Back down in the low post, spins around. Can he get it off the backboard? The foul is cold. And now he will go to the free throw line here for two shots as Vitas Karanjauskas trying to get his mock going in the game. The foul is on Joshua Reeves. Karanjauskas makes the first free throw. This is the second one, but Gear Jonas comes up with a loose ball, and that's a 14 foul now. But Shake to Coach Cannabis and his players. We have to take care of the basketball. They're unable to secure the rebound. Well, now, this is when we need to be a little bit better on the ball, a little bit more clinical. And the Oscars gets rejected. Great defense by Reeves. Right now the confidence from Ritas Vilnius being taken away. The defense unbelievable so far here from Besiktas. Maxu now on the ball. Tries to go down the middle. Puts up a little floater in the air. Doesn't get it. And again, well the foul's been called on Furkan Haltali. But again, you just got to credit. And you can see Ivan Buba just saying to his players, we got to put a body on somebody. Box him out. Because that's been the difference in this game. Besiktas just going for every second chance point. Look at this block by Joshua Reeves there saying, not in my house, this is Istanbul. And as they were saying, Lithuanian, Kipasi Matimo, see you later. Now DJ Wilson checks back into the game. And will be free throws here to Ivan Buvin. Another chance now. Reaches Vilnius to put some points on the board. Ivan Buva able to make one of the free throws now. Coming it down to a 19-point ball game. But at the moment, Ritas Vilnius 
You need to come up with some defensive stops here at the moment. Kills the screen now. Reeves kicks this one out. Well, there's a three in the corner. The three is up. This time they'll get it. Maritas Vilnius almost gave up another rebound there. Karinyaskis again had a very good game against Hereta San Pablo Burgos at the moment. Ritas Vilnius just enjoying a chance of getting to the free throw line. Cuts it down to a 17 point ball game. It was under three and a half to go. I mean, Besiktas have only shot two free throws, but again, it's been quite easy for them on the defense getting out of transition. Transition, excuse me. And also getting some good looks at Diedrich Lawson. Finding a handoff of Reeves. Comes off one screen now. Has a switch against Buva. Crosses over against Ivan Buva. Reeves in the lane, gets caught in the triple team, kicks out in the traveling violation. Great defense. Much better than the collapse by Ritas Vilnius. And that's exactly what they need. Just going to step in and step up at the moment. Karnyauskas now. With under three minutes to go here in the first half. Now tries to back down against Axa. Beautiful spin move, lays it up with a finger roll. Well, that's a Karen Yowskis that we saw last week in Lithuania. Well, he turns it over. Great defense, and now Karen Yowskis. Oh, he turns it over one more time. And now we got a little bit of a throw down. Well, lays it up, excuse me. Well, Karen Yowskis did very well there to come up with the loose ball, but again, turned it right back over, and it's back to a 17-point ball game. Ivan Buba gets a handoff now. We'll get Jonas. And that's a smart play there because now he'll go back to the free throw line. As the foul is on Aksu. This is a clever way now. Very smart here from Ritas Vilnius to try and claw the way back into this game. Is again get into the penalty and get to the free throw line. Well, it's back to a 15 point ball game. As Isaiah Whitehead, he comes back into the game here. Again, a lot of options that the Shakers have. Probably a little bit more depth than Ritas Vilnius. But again, this is something that these two teams would have been aware of. And Douglas Good, Junis trying to force him into turnovers. Whitehead comes off one screen, pulls up from the mid range. Nothing but net. If he comes off the screen like that, it's going to be an easy night here for Besiktas. Ritas Vilnius have to be more aggressive at defending the pick and roll. Karanjauskas now. Finds Maurice and Dort down low to. Ivan Buba, Buba spins around, beautiful little post moves, and that's much better by the Croatian international. We're well, under two minutes to go here. Faritas Vilnius can try and cut this down. Below 10 points, it could give them a bit of breathing space going into the second half, but at the moment, Besiktas having a very easy night here on the offense as Whitehead attacks the basket. Whitehead goes in, hangs, gets rejected, but he called a foul. So Isaiah Whitehead will go to the free throw line. Well, Whitehead makes the first free throw. Karnyauskas now on the ball. 
Gives this one up to gear. Jonas thought about taking the three-pointer. Comes off the screen. Tries to throw it down low. Again, another turnover. And now Besiktas can push this one. He finds Joshua Reeves, and Reeves travels with it. And again, took a very big step before he decided to put the ball on the floor. And it's the correct call from the official. Well, both teams now becoming very sloppy here. Well, it's a very big step, but it's definitely the right call. And again, Karen Yalskis coming off another screen here down the middle. Finds Marisa and Dorr takes the mid-range jump shot, doesn't get it. And now they got numbers here in transition. Finds the goal his way, hangs in the air, gets the yeah, one. And he's now going to go the free throw line here to make a three-point play. Trevon blew it. The blue hit there, you can see, did so well there down the middle. Splits the defense. Was in with a little fanger on. It's a soft little foul there by Maurice Indoor. Very bad foul to give away. Well, now Karen Yalskis here on the ball. Finds Ivan Buva, puts up a jump hook, and Ivan Buva puts up a little baby floater from 10 feet. Cuts it back down to a 17 point ball game, and now it's a timeout here to Besiktas. Well, the one problem so far here for Reeds Vilnius is whenever they make that run, they just turn the ball over, and you can just see Besiktas, they get out in transition, and they just punish the Lithuanians. Well, right now, we're going to listen to the timeouts. Trevon Blewett leading the way with 13 points and four rebounds. Isaiah Whitehead has four assists. Those are the leaders so far here for Besiktas. Well, that's a smooth little spin around, a finger roll here. And Whitehead, again, Buva just giving him too much space there off the pick and roll, allowing him to pull up from the mid range. I mean, you got to come out and stop him right away. You cannot give him any time or space to get that shot off. So now Besiktas with the ball here. With under 40 seconds to go in the first half. They've been in total control of this game at the moment. But right now, Ritas Vilnius. Going to go down low here. Comes it back down. Goes around the middle. Pump fakes. Puts up a tough shot. Doesn't get it. And now Ritas Vilnius can get the last shot here. Of the first half, the ball is in the hands of Karen Yauskas. Well, he's going to run this one down now. Go pick and roll here with Ivan Buva. Karen Yalskis kicks this one out. Well, he's got to get something going now. Karen Yalskis isolates, puts it behind his back. Finds Buva at the end of the first half. Buva gets rejected. Well, great defensive play there. Well, that has been the story of the night. The defensive efforts of Besiktas. Look at this. Finds Buva under the basket. Well, that's a tough one. Great pass there. Oh, it's a great play. Hollis Jefferson with a primetime block there, not allowing Ivan Buva an easy layup. Well, there are the stats from this evening. Ritas Vilnius only 7 20 from within the rainbow. Besiktas 14 420. And the rebound is definitely going in favor of the home team, 17 to 13. But look at that, the assist, 14 to 6. It just shows you that Mishiktas doing a better job of getting on transition. And we'll take a look at some of the game leaders here from this game. 
Trevon Blewett, there you can see 13 points, followed up by Diedrich Lawson with 11. Levon Bouva right now, the only player so far making it happen for Regis Vilnius. Here are the highlights. Well, here are the top highlights in the first half. There you can see the alley-oop with Team Diedrich Lawson throwing that one up to Joshua Reeves, and Reeves just flying up. Well, and there's the quick three-pointer by Trevon Blewett. I mean, he's been the best player in this game so far with 13 points and the good ball movement. There you can see, and the fans, they absolutely love it. They've come here this evening in Istanbul to follow Besiktas. Great defensive play. I mean, a lot of blocks in this game so far from the home team. Well, that was the kick out there. Diedrich Lawson, he can do it down low, but also can pick and pop out to the perimeter. Causing all sorts of problems so far in this game. Faridzis Vilnius, who really have struggled to get themselves into this one. Well, the key for this game for Ritz's Vilnius is to keep getting those good looks, but at the moment, defensively, they have to shut down Besiktas. And you can see Egeman Anna getting that open look.
Adams looking cool, calm, and collected, but he's got to get going. He threads the needle. Oh, what a pass. He takes another one, doesn't get the follow up to Shekulad Hakupa Cell. That is just huge. In the last game against Carlos Cramo, and it really limited his uh, effectiveness and his minutes. Driving down the lane and flushing it was cooked. They have to hurry. Simon crosses. Oh, he loses control, but he gets it back. He puts it up. Oh, off the glass. Incredible. What an incredible shot by Simon. Well, not much time left now. Booth, pump fake, gets it over to Randolph. Randolph, he's got space. He lets it fly. Oh, he nails it with five seconds remaining. So it comes down to this. Ostin looking for a go-ahead basket. Booth dribbling. He gets over for three. He puts it. Oh, incredible! He nailed it!
Well, welcome back now, ladies and gentlemen, to the second half of this basketball Champions League fixture. In game day three between our host, Besiktas, and the visitors, Ritas Vilnius, a group H fixture. Right now, it's the host team completely in dominating control of this game at the moment. It's been very one-sided, of course, at one point in the second quarter, there's only 13 points being scored from the visitors, and they've had to step it up. Only Ivan Buva, the Croatian international, leading the way so far. For Ritas Vilnius. Ritas Vilnius really needs some other players to step in and step up right now just to give him a little bit of inspiration. He's at the moment and he's all Besiktas. All Besiktas being led, of course, by Diedrich Lawson, not to mention Trevon Blewett, who's been having a fantastic game, the pair of them with 13 and 11 points. They have been unstoppable so far here. Isaiah Whitehead's also had a very good game along with Joshua Reeves, but at the moment, Ritas Vilnius Defensively, need to sort themselves out, along with making sure they don't turn the ball over too much. Well, the visitors now will get the first possession here in the second half. They trail by 17 points. Speedy Smith now kicks this one out. It pulls up for a Hail Mary three from downtown. Still can't get to go. Ivan Buga with the offensive rebound. Can't get the put back. He has to kill the rebound. And now Besiktas can push this one. And they went in for the second chance point. They were unable to secure it. Whitehead now curls the screen. Spins out. Fades away in the lane. Doesn't get it. And again, they can't secure a rebound. As Joshua Reeves gets up the loose ball. Around the town, the shot clock. Here comes the pick and roll with Hal Tali. Whitehead now goes down the middle, fades away, gets rejected. Well, comes up a loose ball, doesn't get it. I believe a 24 second violation was called there. Great defense from Vitas Karianowskis there for Ritas Vilnius. In one situation here where Isaiah Whitehead probably just held on to the ball a little too long there, but again, his team does have a 17-point lead as Speedy Smith spits the screen. Smith goes up, lays it up, and again he misses, and it just hasn't been this evening. The rebound secured there by Gitas Radchevichis. Smith in the corner again, and again he can't get it. No foul called there. And now Besiktas can push this one. Whitehead now gives this one up in the lane. They turn it over. And now Smith there with a chance here to put some points on the board. And Speedy Smith lays it up. Cuts it down to a 15-point ball game. Well, Besiktas cannot get too complacent here. Remember, everybody here in Group H is one and one. Now Whitehead with the ball in his hands. On the 10 on the shot clock. There's a switch on defense. Whitehead has to pull up from no man's land, doesn't get it. Two minutes of play here, and Besiktas committed a foul there as Isaiah Whitehead, very frustrated, hasn't been able to get a shot going early on as Speedy Smith wants an unsportsmanlike foul, but I don't think he's going to get that one. And here's the foul. And that's a reaching foul, of course. I think the officials may go to review that one, but again, Isaiah Whitehead does go in to reach for the ball, but it's a question of how they deem it, that reached to have been, of course, but again, we'll find out. Let's hear what the officials have to say about this one.
was a wrap around the so a regular foul has been called that's why I thought it was going to be of course I mean he does go for the ball and it does look like a foul that's based on the attention of going for the ball as opposed to not even having eyes on it and now Vilnius here Kanyaskis comes up one screen there's a switch on defense looking for Ivan Buba and they go down low to the big fella got it by Haltali He stepped out of bounds. It's a canvas turnover by Ivan Buva. Just right there, steps out slightly. <laughs> you can see what Gun Haltali just signaling to the referee where he stepped out of bounds. And here comes a handoff now. The shift is here with a 15 point lead. Been very complacent so far in the early stages, but down the middle. Puts up a circus shot, still can't score. So now Speedy Smith here tries to get out in transition. Smith comes off one screen. Finds Karinowskis. Karinowskis off one screen, goes all the way to the basket. Kicks out, there's a wide open look from the perimeter. Can they get it? No, they can't. Well, the perimeter is shooting so far. Only two three-pointers in this game. Before reaches Vilnius. I mean, that's not a bad look, but again, if they want to get back in this game, they have to start knocking down. Those open shots from downtown. Diedrich Lawson kicks this one out. And a foul has been called there. Ivan Buva, he picks up the fouls. He fouls Isaiah Whitehead as he tried to penetrate. Well, that's a second personal foul of the evening now for Ivan Buva. Smooth move by Whitehead, and finally, the shake just get their first bucket here of the second half, and it only took over three minutes. It's back up to a 17-point ball game. Smith now, there's the pick and pop. They had the shot, didn't take it with the ankle breakup. Kick out, wide open. Finally, they get the third three-point of the game, and this time, it's Gita Sratchevichis. Well, excuse me, no, it's Arnas Bukevichis, excuse me. Oh, it is Red Chevich, excuse me, I got it right. Well, my apologies on that one. That's only the third trade ball of the game. I'll tell you now in the post, got it by Ivan Buva. Tough move, unstoppable. Well, defense. Again, Ivan Buva didn't want to pick up his third foul there. Karen Yalskis gives this one up to Speedy Smith. Smith now the pick and pop. Oh. Now it's been called. This time it's on Haltali. And it's a careless foul to give away because Ivan Buva wasn't catching that pass. And it looks like they're going to make a change now. Sixteen-point lead now to Besiktas. Kicks this one out to Smith. few seconds they force up a Hail Mary three they almost get it and again it's another poor shot here for Ritas Vilnius the moment unable to get any good shots going to the basket crosses over in the lane kicks out good ball movement the three is up the three is good and Besiktas completely punish Ritas Vilnius from downtown and it's back to a 19 point ball game Look at this kick out here. Spots up from downtown. Well, it looks like Karen Yalskis landed very awkwardly, and that could be a very big loss now for Ritas Vilnius. Well, 19 point lead now to the host. And Douglas Gajonis comes up one screen. Speedy Smith takes a penetration. Well, they're making the drives, but not getting it to go in another 24 second violation. And at the moment, Maritza's Vilnius in desperate need of some inspiration right now because it just seems like the moment nobody can step up and really make a play for them at the moment. Down the other end here, Besiktas now flying with confidence. 
With a 19 point lead hit. There's a lob. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. How till he lays it up, and it's too easy at the moment. Well, it was a dump down low to find Diedrich Lawson. He just made a sweet little pass to find Haltali. 21 point lead now to Besiktas. And Jonas now comes up one screen. Back to give Jonas. Crosses over, he pulls up for a quick, quick three point. It doesn't get it. And that's been the story of the night. And now Besiktas can push this. Whitehead now throws it down low to Haltali. Until he spins down the middle. Goes up and it doesn't get it. Goes out of bounds, but it will be. Possession to Besiktas. I think there was 14 seconds on the shot clock, so it will be that exact time. Quick three point off the inbound. The three is up. No good. Speedy Smith now will try to push this one. Finds get Jonas. He had the three, didn't take it. Pulls up in the mid-range, takes a shot, tucks it away. Well, Mindogas, Gilgunas gives a much-needed two points, and he now moves up to six. He's two for three from the field this evening. And just over three and a half to go here. It's Besiktas with a 19-point lead as Hautali kicks this one out to Didrik Lawson down low. Has it back down against Speedy Smith. Pump fakes, fades away, and a foul has been called right at the end of the shot clock. Smart move there by Trevon Blewett. And just made that bit of contact there. Well, watch Trevon Blewett hit as he spins around for the fadeaway to pump fake. Just there, the slightest bit of contact. And that's where the officials called the foul there against Speedy Smith as Blewett makes the first free throw. Well, the American who played at Xavier University. So this is his first season playing professional basketball. I mean, he started in the G League with the Westchester Knicks. And again, what a season he's having so far. As Budkevich just goes to the bench, Ivan Buva has to come back in the game here. Twenty one point lead now to Besiktas. As Maurice and Dor tries to dish it off to Ivan Buva. Buva goes up with it. Well, the Croatian international, and that's what they've needed. Well, great play there by Maurice and Dor, just making that penetration, the dish off. Back to a 19 point ball game. Now, Whitehead comes up one screen, pulls up from the mid range. He's been lethal this evening, doesn't get it. Smith with a rebound. Let's get Jonas. Well, they have a three in transition. The three is up. The three is good. Well, that is a big time shot by Margiris Normantis. Hitting that three pointer in transition. Well, that's his first three pointer of the game. And now the fifth three point of the evening hit. A turnover. Right now, Margiris Normantis making a difference here for Ritas Vilnius. Putting the pressure on Isaiah Whiteside. I think they're saying it came off his foot, so that's why it's been a possession now. Two reaches Vilnius. And there comes a the handoff now. Find Smith. Down low to Ivan Buva. Buva spins around. Bit of contact goes up. Traveling violation. Ivan Buva went for the pump fake, but again, another wasted opportunity there for Ritas Vilnius. And there's a spin around. That's a tough one there. I'm not sure. That's a very tough call. Smith kicks out. Three in the corner. Three is up. The three is in and out. Maurice and Dora now they can push this one. Oh, he's got to turn it over. Speedy Smith. That has been the story of the night here for Ritas Vilnius. We can see what he tried to do. Tried to make the pass to Mindogas Gijunas. But right there, that's where he made the turnover. And that's where he's signaling to his teammates. I can't pick it up. That has been the story. This evening. Well, another turnover. And now Gajunas will lay this one up. He cuts it down to a 14-point ball game. And all of a sudden, 
Reitzes Vilnius not finished yet. Again, this is where Besiktas get a little bit too complacent in their style of play. And really have to realize this game's not over. Under two minutes to go here in the third quarter. As Mehmet Yamor, the captain, checks back into the game for Besiktas. And uh, an illegal screen set there, I believe. And another turnover. And another chance now for Reitzes Vilnius to get themselves back in this one. The offensive foul was set again. The complacency here. Oh, Besiktas probably is going to cost him if they're not careful. Oh, here Jonas goes in. Oh, it's beautiful. Splits the defense. It goes in with a finger roll. And he cuts it down to a 12-point ball game. And all of a sudden, Reitzes Vilnius were down by 21. They've gone on this nine-point run here. His whitehead for three. Doesn't get it. Hoover with a rebound. Well, now the Lithuanians here can cut it down to a 10-point ball game, possibly single digits, if they can hit a three-pointer. Kicks this one out. Anzi Van Buva. Well, the double team getting ready. Buva down the middle. Goes in with a hook shot. Doesn't get it. It's a poor shot. But another turnover. Well, there's a cross-court pass. Good movement. Ondor takes a shot and Endor cuts it down to a 10-point ball game. And all of a sudden, Besiktas, the 21-point lead has disappeared. And maybe, just maybe, the comeback is on. Well, that was a big three-pointer there by Normantis. Just giving a bit of confidence so far here to Ritas Vilnius. Well, that's been a huge third quarter so far here for the Lithuanians. Well, it's down to a 10-point ball game, but again, the question is, for Besiktas, can they respond here? Can they restore order? I mean, they've been in total control this game, but they've just allowed Ritas Vilnius back in this game. Now Besiktas here. There's 15 seconds difference between the game clock and the shot clock, so Whitehead's going to try and slow this one down. And doing now guards. Diedrich Lawson look for a handoff for a few seconds on the shot clock. Lawson now catches, got a fadeaway tough shot, doesn't get it. Well, the foul is being called again. So it will be Besiktas against Besiktas. So it will be possession here to Ritas Vilnius and a chance here with 14.4 to cut into single digits. Well, there was a fadeaway by Dijek Lawson's. The push in the back. Caught against Egehan Arna. And Indolgos Girjunas has been very influential so far defensively. And another foul. And that's going to be free throws here to Maurice Andor, the foul again is called on Eggy. I mean, that's I'm surprised he might not get called for an unsportsmanlike foul on that one. When he has arms all wrapped around him. Well, that's his third personal foul, so he has to go to the bench, but big free throws now here for Maurice Andor. He makes the first one. Well, it's finally a single-digit game, and it hasn't been so far since the first quarter. I right, missed the second one, but an offensive rebound. Another foul's been called. And you can see the, uh, the VIP fan. Well, the VIP fan might get called for the unsports fan like that as he threw the ball down to the ground. Well, 
Well, two more free throws here for Gitas. Ratchevichis. Chance to cut it down to a seven point ball game if he can make both these free throws. Makes the first one. Well, remember, it was a 21 point lead at one point here in the third quarter for the Shiktas. Makes a second one. And Besiktas now are going to make a sub, and they've got 1.6 seconds as Ratchevich just goes to the bench and takes a breather. I think what they're going to try and do is foul immediately, so they bought him. But Besiktas aren't going to take a shot, and at the end of the third quarter, Reeds Vilnius trying to get their way back in this one and cut it down to a seven point ball game. Besiktas fans again enjoying the occasion. They're 17 for 29 from within the rainbow. Rainbow, excuse me, only 5 for 14 from the perimeter. The free throws, again, it's been a good way for Regis Vilnius to get back in this game. Well, there was the pick and pop play there. A great kick out, and that was a much needed three pointer. Well, Bashik this now with a seven point lead. They will get the first possession here in the fourth quarter. And can they hold on to the lead? Whitehead gets a pick and roll hit. Well, Diedrich Lawson has a switch and they go down low to Diedrich. Tries to go down the middle, gets a handoff. They try the mid range shot in and out, doesn't get it. And again, Bukevich secures a rebound. And now reaches Vilnius with the ball in the hands of Mendogas Gujunas. Here comes the screen. Gujunas. Looking for a kick out. Comes off another screen. All right, turns it over. And again, that is where it's gone wrong this evening here. For Rita's Vilnius, when they get that momentum, they make that silly turnover that cost them. So sideline ball here now. The foul is called on Normatis. He comes off one screen now, looking to make the penetration. Kicks out to Diedrich Lawson. Lawson now pulls up from the mid range, takes a shot. Diedrich Lawson, much needed two points here for Besiktas. Restores it back now to a nine point ball game. He now moves up to 13. That's his first point hit. Quite a while. Kid Jonas finds Indora. Made one from the baseline. Doesn't get this one. And now reaches Vilnius. Again, looked like they've cooled off on their comeback that came probably just a little bit too late in the third quarter. Now it's a nine point lead to Besiktas. 
Whitehead crosses over, kicks out. Good ball movement down the middle, and the foul is called on Giajunas. Speedy Smith now, he checks back into the game. Well, two team fouls so far here to reach his Vilnius. It's Whitehead now on the town of the shot clock looking to isolate. Goes in with a smooth little move and he just finishes with a left-handed finger roll and puts it back to a double-digit lead here for Besiktas. Well, 11 point lead now to the hosts. Comes off one screen. Pulls up, gets the yeah, one, that's much better. Well, Margiris Normatis has really been that flair so far here for Ritas Vilnius. Down the middle, makes a bit of contact here with Hatali. And he says, Achu, thank you very much. Well, that is a much needed three point play there. Well, he makes a three-point play, cuts it down to an eight-point eight ball game. Excuse me. Well, so far, Ritas Vilnius 11 to 15 from the charity stripe goes out of bounds, and it will be Ritas Vilnius possession. Callous turnover over there. Speedy Smith with the ball in his hands. Remember, his team has been trailing. They find Maurice and Door. Maurice and Door goes in with a little finger on. He cuts it down now to a six point ball game. And reaches Vilnius. Get closer and closer. The question now for Besiktas can they hold their nerve? Can they maintain their composure? Whitehead now crosses over, pulls up in the mid range. This is where he's been good. Doesn't get this one. Reaches Vilnius come up with a loose ball and now. Speedy Smith with the ball in his hands. We find Steven and Dor. We'll be going out low now to Ivan Buva. Buva backs down against Diedrich Lawson. Goes down the middle. No foul called. Well, great defense there. Well, Ivan Buva's had a very tough game this evening. And a foul has been called, and that's a third team foul now, and I believe that's on Margiris Normantis, and I believe he's going to check out the game now. Six-point lead here to the host. Remember, they were leading by as many as 21. Five on the shot clock now. Got to get something. Reeves for a big three. In and out doesn't get it. The offensive rebound. Well, that is going to punish them. Well, Osmani, simply what Besiktas needed. Somebody to follow up for the second chance point. Speedy Smith now comes off one screen. Let's get Jonas now run to 10 on the shot clock. Has to isolate. Crosses over. Fades away. Tough shot. Got it. Nothing but net by Mindogas Gijunas. I mean, that shot is unbelievable. And he keeps Reeds' Vilnius in this game. We'll down low to Osmani now. Monty got it by Maurice Dor. Maurice Dor picks his pocket. And the big fella is going to try and go all the way. Maurice Dor reverse lift gets rejected. Well, Joshua Reeves said, Not in my house. Well, he thinks he's got it. Reeves says, Welcome to Istanbul, but go home. Smith now on the ball, comes up one screen. Smith attacks it, kicks out. 
Bit of contact, draws a foul. And he'll go to the free throw line now for two shots, and the foul is on Isaiah Whitehead. Maritza Zvonius keep clawing closer and closer. Great drive there by Gitas Ratchevichis. These are big free throws now here for Rajevichis. Hit those two free throws at the end of the third quarter, cutting it down to a seven point ball game. Makes the first one. Well, if he makes this one down now, cuts it down to a four point ball game. And again, Besiktas at the moment stunned into silence. Rajevichis 100% from the charity stripe. Four-point ball game, and Bashik does have to call timeout. And Dietrich Vlorsen's top scores combined for 31 points here. Added to 40 if you count Isaiah Whitehead as well. And at the moment, Ritas Vilnius have really stunned them. They still have a four point lead. They have looked like a better team, but again, it's the second half. The careless turnovers. Well, look at this shot here by Mindogas Gejonas. The fadeaway, Atsi Prashal. You gotta love this guy. With the rejection there. Joshua Reeves said, not in Istanbul, not in our house. Another turnover. I mean, this is unbelievable. The Shiktas have completely self-capitulated. Gets caught in a double team. Wow. I thought Gajonas stepped out of bounds there when he, the ball came off him, but Smith now comes off one screen. Down low to Ivan Buva. Buva struggled this evening, goes up, and he continues to struggle. Well, Ivan Buva right now, right now can't buy a bucket in the low block, and every time I mean, Rita's Vilnius, they could have got themselves back in this game with the amount of chances that they turned the ball over. Split to defense. A foul has been called on Arnes Budkevichis, I believe. Well, that's a fourth team foul now for Rita's Vilnius. That's good news here for Besiktas, because one more foul, and they'll go to the free throw line. So we will be baseline ball now here to Besiktas. Remember, plenty of time left, under five minutes to go. Isaiah Whitehead now, five on the shot clock, got to get something going in the basket. Gives this one, Diedrich Lawson's big three, doesn't get it. But Kevich just secures the rebound, finds Speedy Smith. And now reaches Vilnius with another chance here. Down to Yvonne Buva. Buva gets caught in the double team, kicks out. Big three. Oh, baby! Cuts it down to a one-point ball game. Well, this guy... Marquiris Normatis has really come ready to play. Well, that is now the fifth three-point of the night here for Ritas Vilnius. Isaiah Whitehead comes off one screen. Tries a lob. Another turn. Oh, keep it alive. Six seconds left. Whitehead it has got to pull up. No man's land. Way off the mark. End of the shot clock. Bashik does punish them. And Chervon blew it. Completely saves the day there. For Besiktas. Well, this is a big possession now here for Ritas Vilnius. Well, Nomantis has been a big difference in this game. Comes off a pick and roll. Draws a foul. That's a smart play. 13th foul now here is on Osmani. Well, 13th foul for Besiktas. 
right at the end of the shot clock. Well, it doesn't get him to the free throw line, but it gets him two more fouls away from it. Well, Egehan Anna now checks back into the game here for Besiktas. And this game is going right down to the wire. Maurice Lindor there secures the ball for Speedy Smith. Tries a lob. Oh, I missed it. Maurice Lindor there could have come down with it. And in the end, try to go for the lob. And a foul, and that's going to send. Traveling violation. Wow. Margiris Normatis, very relieved there. Very relieved man as Trevon Blewett was going to go to the free. Well, he thought he was going to get to the bucket. Well, let's have a look here. Well, that's a tough one. Because you sometimes see them cool, sometimes you don't. Well, the thing is for Speedy Smith, big three, doesn't get it. And a foul has been called on Dedrick Lawson. Pushing the back on the rebound. And doesn't send Ritas Vilnius to the free throw line, but it's now for both of these two teams. One foul away. So it will be a baseline ball here to Ritas Vilnius. Well, watch right there. A little shove in the back. Great call by the official. Dedrick Lawson's did put a hand in there. Well, Bashik does get a bench technical foul, so it's going to be a free throw here to Ritas Vilnius. Well, Coach Candibit has to get his players and his staff under control. Well, that's a big free throw now for Mindogas Gajunas. Makes the free throw. Cuts it down to a two point ball game. Well, there was a three pointer. There was the foul by Dedrick Lawson. So now Ritas Vilnius with a chance here to possibly tie the game up. And if they can find Margiris Nomatis on the perimeter, they could possibly take the lead. Well, there's the man, the shooter they want the ball in the hands of. And they get to Speedy Smith now. Smith comes off one screen, pulls up in the mid-range. Speedy Smith doesn't get it. And the foul is going to be called on Maurice Andor. So now it's going to be two free throws here. Two Besiktas with 2.54 to go in the game. I think Diedrich Lawson thought he was going to get called for the foul, but two free throws now here for Besiktas. These are big free throws now here for Besiktas. Oh, he missed it. Well, at a time when you want Trevon Blewett to step up and hit the shots, this would be the moment. Well, he can put him up by three points if he hits this one. Well, he makes a second free throw. And it's a three-point ball game. Still plenty of time left here. Under three minutes to go. Now Margiris Nomatis comes off one screen, steps back, takes the mid-range. He's been lethal, and he stays on fire. Well, Mano Vardas, Margiris Nomatis. Well, he lets everybody in the gym know he has been the savior this evening for Ritas Vilnius. And now Blewett hit. Remember, any foul was sent him to the free throw line. Blewett gets rejected. Well, what a block. And now Ritas Vilnius with a chance to take the lead. Well, they're going to slow this one down. Now they got the ball in the hands of Speedy Smith. Smith now attacks the basket. Kicks out. Big three. Oh, he doesn't get it. Well, goes out of bounds. Aritas Vilnius will get it back with 14 on the shot clock. Well, this is a big possession now. Well, if Margiris Nomads has hit that three-pointer, it would have been 
huge occasion. And now in the hands of Speedy Smith. Well, Smith has had a tough game this evening. Hasn't been able to get things going. Now run to 10. Finds Marisa Dor, and this time he connects with it. And Ritas Vilnius take the lead by one for the first time since the first quarter. Well, Bashik just now trailing for the first time. Kick this one out. Reeves now got it by Speedy Smith. Kicks out to Whitehead. Down low to Diedrich Lawson. Lawson, he lays it up, and he puts Besiktas back up by one. Well, Diedrich Lawson, big time shot there in the paint. Had the mismatch, guided by Margiris Normantis, the savior of Ritas Vilnius this evening. And Ritas Vilnius had the call timeout. See both these two teams with only five three point field goals, but it's been really the comeback in the second half here. A very quiet but slow comeback here from Ritas Vilnius. I mean, this guy, Margiris, has just been unbelievable. And there was the lob as Maurice and Dor able to connect with it. And as I mentioned, Normans has been unbelievable. But watch Diedrich Lawson's here, cements himself in the low block, spins around, just gives a baby jump hook off the backboard. Well, this is a big moment now. 1.30 to go here in the fourth quarter. Remember, Ritas Vilnius were down by as many as 21. Well, they got themselves back in this game. Remember, you know, their top players, Ivan Buva and Speedy Smith, have struggled this evening. They found themselves back in it. Margiris Normantis, his perimeter shooting. And Speedy Smith now will bring the ball up here. Goes pick and roll. Smith attacks. Smith goes up. Gets rejected. Goes out of bounds. And it will be Besiktas' possession. Well, Diedrich Lawson's. Look at this. Diedrich Lawson's with the ultimate block shot. He does just enough there to stop Speedy Smith from getting to the free throw line. No time to panic now for Ritas Vilnius. Remember both teams here. Any foul will send him to the free throw line. Lawson's now gets a handoff. We're under 10 on the shot clock. Down to Diedrich Lawson's. Kicks out. Big corner. Three. Oh, my Lord. Igechalar. Teshekular. Besiktas. One minute left here. Kicks out. Big three-pointer. Atsi Prashol. You gotta love this game. Kitas Ratchevichis hits a big time three pointer and keeps Ritas Vilnius in this game. A oh, big, big play now. Down to Diedrich Lawson's. Lawson's in the lane. Lawson's gets rejected. Well, great help side defense there by Maurice Andor. And now seven seconds on the shot clock. Watch Andor. Get out of here. You are not welcome in your own house. Well, this is a big timeout here for Beshikta. Seven seconds on the shot clock. Well, this is a big possession here 
for Besiktas. They're up by one point. They got seven seconds on the shot clock. Don't forget the inbound now. They're looking for a love pass. Inbounds. He almost turned it over. Down to Dietrich Lawson's. Lawson spins. Lawson's traveled with it. And now with 27.1 seconds left, Ritas Vilnius with one more chance here as they're down by one point. Well, Lawson's made a spin. That's definitely a travel. You can see he lifted up his pivot foot there as he tried to make the move going to the basket. And now Speedy Smith. Smith now comes up one screen. Two seconds difference here between game clock. Smith gives this one up. Seven on the shot clock. Smith, big three, doesn't get it. Goes out of bounds, but it will be Besiktas ball with 4.3, and I think they're asking for a review there. I think they're gonna review this one. Well, Whitehead and Diedrich Lawson's took a tumble going to the ground. Well, there was a three-pointer by Speedy Smith. It's hard to see from that angle. So the officials now will review this one. And there's a three-point shot. Hits the side of the rim. Now, who does the last touch come off of? Oh, it's very tough to see from that angle. Very hard. I wonder if they're going to look at calling a possible foul there, maybe. I don't know. I mean, there's the shot. Well, it's even harder to see from that angle. Because Bukevicius and Diedrich Lawson's both go for it, but... The only way to see is from in front of them. Right there. I think that comes off Deidre Glossens maybe. But they get, it's very tough because does Bukevich's have a hand on it maybe? I don't know. It's very hard to see. Well, here comes the decision. It's going to be Rita's Vilnius ball. So now with 4.3 seconds left, can Rita's Vilnius... Well, they're going to call a timeout now and draw maybe one last play up. Check this now. Again, it seems like they're holding on to every last play hit. As Ritas Vilnius slowly but very surely have clawed their way back into this one and have given themselves now one last chance hit. With 4.3 seconds left, they'll get the ball sideline. You can see Coach Candyman saying, don't foul, don't send him to the free throw line. Well, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is what it's all about. This is the Basketball Champions League. Rita Spilnius with one last chance. To get it inbound to Ivan Buva. Buva goes to the basket. Foul's called. Ivan Buva is going to go to the free throw line. And the foul is on Diedrich Lawson. Well, Ivan Buva with two free throws. Diedrich Lawson tried to block him. Well, these are big free throws here.
Well, the question is, are the officials talking this one over again? Maybe, I don't know. I think they're going to review this one one more time. Well, the anxiety for both these two teams. Well, let's see what we have in store here. Let's take a look at the replay. Well, I think he went across his arms. I mean, it's tough to see, of course, but... Oh, it's definitely a foul. Has to be a foul. I think what the officials actually were reviewing maybe was how much time was left on the clock for the foul. So these are big free throws now here for Ivan Buva. Massive free throws. And you can hear all the Lithuanian fans back in Vilnius saying, Brasham, please, Ivan Buva. If there was ever a time when the practice counted, now is that time. And Ivan Buva now will step up. 1.6 seconds left. Down by one. Huge free throws. Oh, he missed it. Well, if he makes this one, can send him into overtime. He has to make it. Well, he got Bukevicis and Maurice Andor going in for a follow-up. Buba has to make this free throw. Makes it. It's a tie game here with 1.6 seconds left. And now Besiktas maybe have one last chance here. Takes a dribble, throws it up. Almost got it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are headed into overtime. Maritas Vilnius came back. Ivan Buva, one for two from the free throw line. And has done just enough here to send this game into OT. Well, what a game it's been here in game day three of the basketball champs. League. Remember, Besiktas will lead him by as many as 21 points, but Maritas Vilnius slowly but surely have got themselves back into this game. Both these two teams with only six three-point field goals. Well, it's been the free throws. It's been the difference that's allowed Maritas Vilnius to get back in this one. key for this overtime is they usually say in the world of basketball the first team that scores usually is the team that goes on to win but that might not be the case tonight I mean it has been a roller coaster of a game this evening So now we get set to get overtime underway. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is why you come watch the Basketball Champions League. 
Week in, week out here. And it's now Rita's Vilnius will get the first possession here in OT. Well, Margiris Normantis now comes off one screen. He's been influential so far in the comeback here. And we go down low down Maurice Sundor. Well, he has struggled this evening. Spins around, spins again. Kicks out, big three, but Kevichis doesn't get it. And again, the perimeter shooting from these two teams has been very rocky this evening. Now the shift is here with another chance. Whitehead goes in, hangs in the air, doesn't get it. Gil Jonas comes up with a loose ball now. He can push this one in transition. It looks like he might slow this one down. Back to Maurice Sandor. In the corner, Margiris Normantis gets it. Well, he's been the difference. He's been nailing it all night long. The assist coming from Marie Sundor. Well, there's the first icebreaker here. And overtime going to the visitors from Vilnius. The Whitehead has the mismatch guarded by Andor. Diedrich Lawson's under the basket. Easy layup. Well, he gambled on the defense there by Bukevicius, and again, that's what Bishik just needs to do. Throw it down low to Diedrich Lawson's. Three and a half to go here in overtime. Finds Normantis. Comes off another screen. Well, Normantis throws it away. Very poor play there. Trying to throw a lob there to Maurice Andor, and again, he wasn't open. And again, there you can see going down low. Schick is trying to use the size. Finding Diedrich Lawson's kicking out. They turn it over. Bukevich just comes up with it. He's going to lay it up. No foul called. They try to love pass. And they turn it over. And Bashik just, just can't take care of the basketball. I mean, it's one turnover after the next for this team. Maritas Vilnius. Speedy Smith comes back into the game. Well, it's been very sloppy basketball. But at the same time, very excited. And we'll find Gia Jonas now. Going to pick a roll here. And Bukit Chavitsis tries to spin around. Hangs in the air. And he turns it over. Well, now the mental fatigue here really settling in for these two teams. And they try to double team. Maurice on door there, you can see he needs to calm down. Doesn't want to get called for a technical foul. Well, there's a foul right there. He reached in. There's no need to reach there. They just sent him to the free throw line with that foul. Well, Kevich just now goes to the bench. He takes a breather. Well, these are big, big free throws now here by Egehan Arna. Makes the first one. And he ties the ball game up. Oh, he missed it. Well, tie game now, 72 apiece hit. And Speedy Smith here on the ball. Finds Ivan Gruber, both these two players are going to be the best players for this Rita's Vilnius team. They have struggled this evening. As Maurice Sandor can't hit the shot. And now Bashik is with a chance to take the lead here. Whitehead now gives this one up. They go down low to Diedrich Lawson's. Lawson's turns it over. Maurice Sandor comes up with it. Finds him again. Another turnover. I mean, this is sloppy basketball at the moment. They can't finish a real end to end stuff. Why do these teams seem to have any composure right now? Maritas Vilnius decides to slow this one down. Smith now on the ball. Looking to isolate. Got it by Diedrich Lawson. Goes in, Fangerol, and he goes over the backboard. Whoa, could have hit the popcorn man in the head. Or the mop boy, but both these two teams out of the mental fatigue really settling in. And there's a bit of contact there. It looked like a good move, but went right over the basket.
And now Besiktas here with one last chance. I say one last chance, excuse me, another chance. Whitehead now comes off one screen. Well, he got the mismatch with Dedrick Lawson in the low block, and now Whitehead looks like he wants to isolate. Hesitates in the lane, gets it to drop. Why is there a Whitehead tough move? Much needed two points here for Besiktas. He gives him a two point lead here with over a minute to go. Now Margiris Normatis, he draws a foul. He'll go back to the free throw line. Smart move there. The foul is on Egehan. Well, swipes through and there. Again, a very intelligent play there, knowing that his team were in the penalty. That's a fourth foul there on. Ivan Buba now will go to the bench to take a breather. Well, Margiris Nomantis has been phenomenal in this game. Really has been the player that has inspired Ritas Vilnius. Shooting 5 for 10 from the field this evening. Enjoying them coming from the perimeter. Makes it 2 for 2 from the charity stripe. Ties it up at 74 apiece. We're under a minute to go here in the first overtime. We could go to double OT, OT this evening, ladies and gentlemen. We don't know. Whitehead now comes up two screens. Well, they got Diedrich Lawson's got it by. Lawson, excuse me. Got it by. No matches. Love pass. Good ball movement. Goes out of bounds. Now 1.3 seconds left on the shot clock. Besiktas will have the ball. Well, the shake this will call timeout, and Speedy Smith gets away with that one. I mean, he does reach across. I think Hollis Jefferson wants a foul, but Coach Candemir now will try to draw something up here. 1.3 on the shot clock in overtime. Well, this is what coaches get paid good money for. Of course, we got two of the finest coaches here in the basketball Champions League. Well, for Coach Giedrich, he needs to make sure his team come up with a stop hit. Well, for Coach Kandemir, with 1.3 on the shot clock, he needs to make sure in overtime that his team can either get a good shot off or get fouled. But either way, it's a tie ball game. Well, if you're not nervous right now, something is wrong with you. Ratchevich is there having a matchup with Diedrich Lawson. I turn it over. It goes out of bounds, but it will be. Well, it will be possession back to Besiktas now with one tenth of a second left on the shot clock. One tenth now, baseline ball here to Besiktas. Essentially, you got to throw it up and just do something with it. There's the lob. A 24 second violation is called. So now, Ritas Vilnius here again, like they had at the end of regulation, with 33.2 seconds left. They will get a chance here. Speedy Smith now looking for options. Comes off one screen. Smith looking to isolate. Kicks out to Bukevichis. Bukevichis. I think they called a possibly an offensive foul there. Oh, that's a poor shot. 
Kevin just, I think, with the elbow. Now, because that's an offensive foul, I believe that's not going to be free throw shots. So now, the officials are going to review here for an unsportsmanlike foul. Look at the elbow hit. Well, Bukovic is there, does connect with the elbow. Question is, do they call the unsportsmanlike foul? which means it will be two shots and possession. Also need to justify how much time is on the clock left. So now Besiktas here with 50.8. They will get the last shot. So I'll try and dribble this one down. Well, this is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. Isaiah Whitehead with the ball in his hands. He's going to run this one down. Got it by Margiris. Normatis. Well, here comes Whitehead. Whitehead penetrates behind the back. Shoots it. Doesn't get it. And we are going into a second overtime. Well, Isaiah Whitehead had the chance there to put his name in basketball Champions League history books. Beautifully executed. Penetrates him with the right hand behind the back. Right against Marisa Dort. Doesn't get the drop. It looked like Kyrie Irving. Excuse me. It looked like the shot for the LA Clippers. I, again, I got that one wrong. It looked like the shot for the Toronto Raptors on that one. Kawhi Leonard against the Philadelphia 76ers. But this is the basketball Champions League. Besiktas and Ritas Vilnius go into double overtime, 74 apiece. Well, there you can see the statistics. Ritas Vilnius, 18 for 43 from within the rainbow. Besiktas, 24 for 44. And the visitors with only one more three-pointer, thanks to Margiris Nomantis, who hit that three-pointer right at the beginning of OT. And he's the leading scorer so far with 16 points for the visitors. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, this has been a phenomenal basketball game. If you're just joining us, Besiktas had a 21-point lead in the third quarter. Maritza's Vilnius within moments cut it down to seven points and, again, forcing this game into overtime. Both teams having a chance to win this at the end of regulation and at the first OT, but as it stands, we are headed into a second interval. And you could really see that the mental fatigue that settled in for both these two teams, they were really struggling to get good shots off, and it became a very scrappy overtime. So we'll see what they have left in the tank. Shake this now. We'll get the first possession. Whitehead spins around, goes in, kicks out. Now, Wallace well, Jefferson gives up to Joshua Reeves. Off the backboard, doesn't get it. Another missed attempt there by Besiktas. Now, Margiris Normantis, leading scorer here for Vitas Vilnius with 16. And Douglas Jonas now. Kukevicius. 
under the basket, finds Bukevicius. A three second violation. It's just turnover after turnover. It's been like that for both of these two teams here. We can say that both these two teams really have struggled this evening, but it's been a very exciting basketball game to watch, to say the least. I mean, now Diedrich Lawson, remember, any foul will send them both to the free throw line. Kicks up the Whitehead. Whitehead thought about taking the three point. He's got to take it now. Hell Mary. Oh, my Lord. E. Get Well, that is good night, Istanbul. From no man's land. And he gives a three point lead to the hosts. I mean, Dogus get Jonas now on the ball. Comes off another screen. Finds Kevichis. Big three. Well, airballs it. And now Beshik does with all the momentum going forward. Well, turns it over. And then you can see. Isaiah Whitehead saying he felt he got fouled on that one. I think he might have a case because he was definitely held there a little bit, but they let the play go. It was a tangle of the arms probably, so that's actually not bad by the officials to let the play continue. But again, Ritas Vilnius with another chance here. Stay in bay here as Ivan Buber comes back into the game. Buber now. Tries to go down the middle. Buva puts up a jump hook, doesn't get it. Well, the follow up, no good. And now, Diedrich Lawson will slowly give this one up. You can see now both teams just trying to get over the final hurdle. Diedrich Lawson kicks out the Hollis Jefferson. Shakes and bakes, spins around, fades away. Right at the end of the shot clock. That is B-E-A beautiful by Rondé Hollis Jefferson. The shake and bake and the finish. It's Margiris Nomantis now on the ball. The foul has been called, so he'll go back to the free throw line and much needed two points here for Ritas Vilnius. I think the foul is going to be called on Joshua Reeves, so that's his third personal foul. He makes the first one. He now moves up to 17 points. Cuts it down to a four point ball game. Makes the second one. Well, that was really big there. For Ritas Vilnius cutting it down to a three point ball game now with just over two minutes to go here in second overtime. Well, now Bashik does here. In that case, just need to get fouled and slow time down. Whatever it takes is Isaiah Whitehead. Gives up to Joshua Reeves. Reeves forces it up. Gets fouled and he'll go back to the free throw line right at the end of the shot clock. Smart move there by Joshua Reeves. Bukevich just now has to leave the game. He fouls out. Well, these are big, big free throws here for Joshua Reeves. And again, he's been very quiet so far. But he missed a free throw. Well, that could that be very crucial for Besiktas and their hope to close this game out. Oh, I missed them both. Well, the pressure just getting to him is now Mendogas Gijonis now on the ball. And again, another chance hit. Margiris Normatis. And an offensive foul. Good call there. You can see that Maurice Andor just holding on to the screen, setting a moving screen.
Well, three point bowl game now with just over one and a half to go here in double OT. And now here comes the pick and roll, Dejic Lawson, along with Joshua Reeves. He's now gives this one up to Isaiah Whitehead. Whitehead hit a Hail Mary three, takes another one, doesn't get it. Yvonne Buba secures a rebound. Well, now here's been the problem here for Regis Vilnius. It's almost like there's no gas in the tank. It's Margiris Nomantis. Gives up to Buba. Cross court to Mindogas Gajunas. Margiris Nomantis. And a foul is, oh no, hits the foot, so it will be fresh 14, I believe, now. For Ritas Vilnius, and they're struggling to get a shot off at the moment. Well, inbound now, we're under a minute to go. Good Jonas. Kicks out, big three, can he get it? Gets the three-pointer, and he ties it up, and it's that man again. I mean, that is huge. Gitas Radjevicius. Well, if you are watching in Lithuania right now, man, Patenka Klepšinas, I mean, I love basketball. But in the end, he lays it up. And Isaiah Whitehead puts Pashiktas back up by two points. And another timeout's gonna be called here. I mean, look, Ivan Buba too slow on the house side defense. Well, he couldn't do it because Rondé Hollis Jefferson would have been wide open in the corner. And after Gitas Ratchevichis hit a huge three pointer, keeping him in this game. End of the shot, doesn't get it. Well, there you can see. Well, Besiktas just need to get fouled right now. And there's the foul. And now we'll send him to the free throw line. Well, 16.4 seconds left here in overtime. Well, the foul is on Ivan Buva. And these are going to be big free throws. From Rondé, Hollis Jefferson. Makes the first one. And he puts him up by three points. Now they're huge free throws. And right now you can see all these players just trying to get over the final hurdle here. Three-point lead to Besiktas. 16.4 seconds left in double OT. All right, missed it. Buva with a rebound. And now Ritas Vilnius. They have to get a three-pointer here to tie this game up. Smith. Jonas has a three, doesn't get it. Buba with the follow-up, kicks it out. Another three, way off the mark. Well, ladies and gentlemen, at the end of this game, Besiktas win this one 82 to 79 over Ritas Vilnius in double overtime. Well, this game went right down to the wire. But in the end, the hosts, they hold on. Unbelievable game.
Well, there you can see the stats for this game. Very unbelievable finish, of course. Reads us Vilnius, 8 for 28 from the three-point line. And that was the big difference in the game. Two rebounds in favor. I mean, they did come back into it. There wasn't a lot to separate these two teams. The team from Lithuania battled very hard, but the home side dug deep and they held on to the victory. Well, Trevon blew it in. Diedrich Lawson finished scoring with 21 and 17. I know Mantis, an inspirational performance from him. Well, here was a three point again. Jonas hesitated right there. Probably wanted Mark Gears, no Mantis, to get that shot. And there was a final three there. But in the end, that is as the game finished. Well, inspiring performance, of course. And there you can see, I mean, look at that right there between the fans and the players of Besiktas. A fantastic basketball club with great support here in Istanbul in Turkey. What a debut from that young man, Aksu. A very, still a teenager, actually. And that was just key now. Well, we'll take a look at the highlights here. I mean, what a phenomenal game it was here live in Istanbul. Game day three of the Basketball Champions League. Well, we thank you for joining us here at Double OT Thriller between two teams who were desperate to come out with a big victory. Here are the highlights now from overtime. What a game it was. I mean, Hollis Jefferson, that was the dump down from Dedrick Lawson. You got to credit the spirited comeback here from Rita's Vilnius. I mean, they did so well here to get back in this game. They collectively kept pegging back in the deficit. But in the end, just as they got over the, I mean, they looked like they were about to win it on multiple occasions, but just couldn't get over that final hurdle. That is as it will end here this evening. As we mentioned, phenomenal performance between both these two teams really going down to the wire. And not only one, but two overtimes. And in the end, reward themselves with a very big victory. You could say in the fair argument, of course, to Ritas Vilnius, they're both Speedy Smith and Ivan Buba, who arguably are their best players, arguably, excuse me, did not have the best game. But they will walk away with the victory. Besiktas, of course, I mean, that was a huge three-pointer by Isaiah Whitehead. Well, not on that one, of course, but in the double OT. That secured the win for them. Oh, a huge, huge three-pointer, of course. That sealed the deal. But it was that kind of evening. Diedrich Lawson coming very big this evening. Reeves in the corner with a massive tray ball. Well, there was the kick out. Huge three that kept him in this game. But Kevichis... Well, there again was Margiris Nomatis hitting a huge three-pointer. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we thank you for joining us here in Istanbul. For tonight's fixture between Besiktas and Ritas Vilnius. But for now, we'll take a look at the final standings here in Group H. Besiktas now will move to 2 and 1.
They will temporarily top the group, depending how it goes between Yui Baskets Oldenburg and Hereda San Pablo Burgos. Remember, Besiktas did lose on opening night of the basketball champs against the two time champions of San Pablo Burgos. So now it will be interesting to see how that game, that game tips off very soon, actually. You can check that one out here. But for now, it is Igechalar. Good night from Istanbul, Turkey, and the Basketball Champions League.